If your ink too slow and your nib won't flow, here's one of the places that you can go. Larry is here to see you through with Mr. Announcer and Cubby too. It's Larry's Fountain Pen Review. I'm not old. Well, maybe I got a little skin sagging here. A little there. Ah, my beautiful body skin. Oh my lord. No. Ah. In the year 2525, <laughs> if Larry is still alive. Oh, mercy, mercy. Oh, I, I, I'm melting. My beauty. Oh. oh. Ah, ah, wow, ah, ah, well that was horrible, that was just a thought, ah, all right boys and girls out there talking to the adults, can you help me, sing along with me, in the year 2525, if man is still alive, <laughs> would you bear me all those fountain pens, I don't care what size, oh, Give me a head with hair. Oh, long, beautiful hair. Oh, I feel good. Da -da 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 -da. Like you know that I should now. Come on now, hit that button. All right, anyway, oh, I forgot where I was. All right, here we go, folks. Back to reality. Huh? So anyway. Yes, I'm awesome. I know it. I'm cool. I'm drooling. I love it. I'm still alive. I can breathe. All right, here we go. Here is a really cool fountain pen. Chinese made. Very, very affordable. A very nice looking pen. And it writes very well. It comes in different colors. This one is uh, kind of a pink maybe. Lalic or something? That's a pink. So we're going to take it out of the little sleeve like that. And if you look at this pen closely, what does it remind you of? Give you some hints. I'm going to point. Bam! Bam! I do like these pins a lot, and I have quite a few of them. Bam! This is the Wink Song fountain pin. We'll pull off the cap. It does post nice and securely, no problems at all. And it does have the ink window to let you know that you'll have ink in it. And you go down the barrel. It has a really nice grip on it section. And that will accommodate any size fingers. I really, really love it. Very comfortable. And the nib is extra fine, I believe. Yep. Mm -hmm. Now, does the Lamy nib fit on this? Well, that's for another review, but I say I wouldn't try it. I have put on a Lamy nib before on the urine, and it fitted. Then I tried a different size nib, but it wouldn't really fit the way it should. So I don't know about this one yet. That's another time and date to check out that nib and I will. So let's unscrew this fabulous pen. And it comes with a converter and it will use a cartridge. Now remember, like I said, if you're putting it this way and it's not fitting securely, that means because it's wrong I know sometimes we can get confused. So it's on this end. 
and it'll go right in there nice and securely and just twist the top of the converter and you can have your inks put in and then put that back in the housing it comes from and have a great time writing so what I'm going to do again is just dip my pen okay rubber oyster and I may use some pink let's use this right here we're going to use hot pink all right Again, just dip my pen. Make sure I got ink on this baby. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now let me just do one thing here, get that nib a little wetter. Look at that. See, you have to get that nib kind of wet, and it's going to really do a good number. It is extra fine. A lot of times I find these, uh, the Chinese pens, find the medium, extra fine to fine, but maybe this one is a true extra fine. So let's see how the reverse writes. I don't think too good, but we'll try. See, I was right, yep. Down stroke, cross stroke. So there you have it, the wing song. Yeah, they look like the Lombie, but they're not. So, it's a decent pin. And uh, these are very, very, very affordable. You can have a lot of fun with them, especially newbies. Learning about fountain pens is very important. To learn about the nibs, sizes that you enjoy the most. Because I can tell you all day long, oh, you like this nib, or you like that nib, or you'll like this pen, you know, it's great for the buck. But that's not going to make it correct for you. Because you may say, well, I don't like the way this pen looks, feels. I don't like uh, the uh, way it writes. It writes too dry. It does this. It does that. And then you'll find me on the other end saying the positive good things about it. Really, you know, you can't go wrong for the buck. If you lose it, you don't have much money invested in this. They're a great little pen. And uh, only one way to find out. Try it. Folks, that's going to do it for today. Hope you enjoyed the review. Hope it made some sense to you and for your newbies. And if you're new to my channel, welcome, my friends, to my channel. I hope to deliver some great reviews to you. A lot of fun, a lot of excitement. Uh, I'm that kind of new kind of guy that bounces all around the place. So be safe, my friends. A lot of peace and love to you. And as always, please don't text and drive. You're hearing it from the pin guy in Fort Worth, Texas. Bye-bye. Peace out, baby. Be right.